first. Once we get our front cap removed, we're able to see the pins. And we've got a catch on either side that's going to lock the pin in place. So what we've got to do is actually release these catches off the pin. So we're going to go in here with the screwdriver, pick up that catch, and then right when we pick up the catch, we're going to pull the pin back and it's released it. So other side, I'm going to pull that catch, pull it back just a little bit, releases the pin, and I can pull it backwards. Just like that. Now, to install the pins, just doing the reverse procedure. Make sure you have the pin oriented correctly so the catch will grab. Go ahead and put the wire in through the back. Latches, once you hear that click, you know you're good. So same deal, wire through the back. Wait for that click. And you can, you can pull the pin back just a little bit if you want, just to make sure that those catches actually fall back into position. And as long as those catches are back flush, then we'll take our top cap. Reinstall it once you get your click. Now you've got a connector that's been repinned.